in this video log I am going to address three main points. Firstly, um, does the text give a realistic view of prison life? Secondly, why might these descriptions differ from records from prison inspectors? And thirdly, um, highlight strengths and weaknesses of the source and why or why not they may betray the full story. The three main sources that I focus on are from Matthew and Florence, uh, Davin Hill, Port Hill, uh, Taylor and Jellicoe. In terms of do these sources offer a realistic view, um, we can see from all three sources about prison life, they seem very um, far reached in terms of prison life and seem to be written to persuade the audience that prison life was better as you might more educated and less likely to offend. Um, all the sources focus primarily on Mount Joy and the conditions uh, associated with them and um, focus on improvements such as education and the work carried out by the women in the prison. Secondly, um, why might these predictions differ from prison inspectors annual reports um, these predictions may differ from annual reports as the um, counts are over a shorter period of time and are more informal manner as opposed to prison in, um, inspectors who highlight changes from year to on a yearly basis from year to year and they would um, work to carry out improvements such or such as improvements or what needs to be improved within the prison. Furthermore, annual reports would also differ as they would produce um, more statistics and figures about what prison life was like and the conditions within and the changes from year to year or their last visit to the prison. Thirdly then, the strengths and weaknesses of uh, these types of sources. Strengths are that uh, all three sources are um, together in saying that prison life was pretty dismal and that Mount Joy was um, very poor in its standards of prison life. Uh, weaknesses, the author's um, agenda may be persuaded by what they're seen in the prison or what they want you to take from the prison experience and therefore it may be um, persuaded to their point of view. Furthermore, I see the strengths of these um, sources as they were different in compared to prison records as to give a more different account of what goes on in prison life or as they are more focused to the daily um, goings on within the prison as opposed to Prisoners, uh, prison officers account that does focus on the whole general prisoners as a whole as opposed to key individuals within the prison. I feel that these readings are uh, written to show that prison life is improving although there still is uh, high levels of wrongdoing as well. Finally, in conclusion then, from these three points, we can learn that um, these three sources can, are realistic in a certain point, but uh, are unrealistic as they are not given the full story of present life and are written in a short period of time. However, the same the point that the three of them are making the same point about present life is also a strength of all three sources but um, I think they are more on realistic about present life